the best TV show of all time. Today, I will be deciding the best TV show of all time, but you know what? You can also decide. Head over to my Instagram and you can decide yourself what is the best TV show ever made. But today, these are my rankings. I'm sure a lot of you are going to disagree with it. But let's get straight to it. Keeping up with the Kardashians and Grey's Anatomy. Now, I'll be real. Keeping up with Kardashians, it's a, it's a jolly funny show. Grey's Anatomy is just a bit dead, let's be real. It's a hospital thing. Like, Keeping up with the Kardashians is our first TV show through community and sex education. Now, I can't lie, I got maybe five episodes deep into community. It's dead. That people, that, that is it's the office and the good place. Let's think about this here, let's think. Guys, let's think. Just take a breather. Just take a breather. Guys, chill. Office, so funny. Steve Carroll, good place. It's just full of plot twists. Something's always gonna happen next. Kristen Bell, what a jokester. There's only one choice, isn't there? The Office is going through. The US version, by the way. The US version. Love Island and Suits. In Love Island is going through. It's just a goofy concept. I love it. Umbrella Academy, Final Space. I think that's pretty obvious. I think everybody in, a, in their right minds would pick this one. It's Umbrella Academy. These are genuinely two of the best TV shows ever made. Brooklyn Nine-Nine, Modern Family. TV show going into the next round. Modern Family. Modern Family is going through. Modern Family is going through. Modern Family is going through. I don't know if you know yet, but Modern Family is going through. That's what's happening. Stranger Things and WandaVision. Parks and Recreation and How I Met Your Mother. Simpsons and Cobra Kai. This one is controversial, I can't lie. Similarly to The Good Place, there's always a plot twist, and I love that. I love a good plot twist, you know? When the plot just twists, I love it. The Simpsons is an all-time classic, you know what I mean? Simply because of Peyton List, Cobra Kai is going through. Doctor Who and the Big Bang Theory. But Doctor Who is just, it's just boring, man. It just, it, ta it takes me back to GCSE media studies, and GCSE sucked. So I'm going The Big Bang Theory, Sheldon and all that. Euphoria and Breaking Bad. I've never watched either of those two shows before. I've seen more clips from Breaking Bad than I have seen off of Euphoria. I'm gonna go for Breaking Bad. <laughs> Look, Kim's Convenience is going through. Oh, this is a good matchup. A lot of you probably haven't watched this, but Shit's Creek and The Boys. Now I have a good friend who does like The Boys, but he's not gonna like his boys decision of this. Shit's Creek is going through. Game of Thrones, Phineas and Ferb. I think there's only one answer to this. There's 104 days of summer vacation to school comes around just to end it. But the annual problem of our generation is trying to find a good way to spend it. Like me. Sopranos going through. Some people may say Friends is overrated. Some people may say Rick and Morty is underrated. Some people might say Fr Rick and Morty need some more friends. What? Friends is going through. Well, my gangster Roonies, that is the round of 32. We now move into 16 TV shows. Keeping up with the Kardashians and sex education. I'm gonna go sex education. For some of you guys, this is probably the most easiest choice of your life, but every, t every episode I've watched of Love Island, it just is a crack up, especially the Australian version. The Office is more iconic, I would say, and I think therefore I have to push it into the next round. Umbrella Academy and Modern Family. I think anybody in their right mind will easily choose Modern Family. That's that's not even a question. Stranger Things is going through. There's there's no doubt there. Talking about doubt. Cobra Kai and the Big Bang Theory. Have to ponder. Have to ponder. Now listen, I don't cry to many things. I rarely cry at movies. I rarely cry at sad moments in my life. But when the Big Bang Theory ended. But Cobra Kai is still going, and Cobra Kai is still interesting, so for that reason, Cobra Kai, I want to see how it ends, Cobra Kai is going through. This video is going to be very controversial, by the way, but I'm going to go Breaking Bad. This is way more difficult than it should be. Fin Phineas and Ferb is my childhood, you know? I'm going to I'm going to... Uh, Phineas and Ferb. And the final round of the round of 16, The Sopranos and Friends, I mean, yeah. <laughs> Friends is going through. We go into the final eight. Let's get straight to it. Phineas and Ferb versus Friends. Friends is going through. Cobra Kai and Breaking Bad. 
Uh, I've never watched Breaking Bad in my life. I'm just, I'm throwing it in the open. Listen guys, guys, it's fine. I'm not, I'm not taking it personally. Cobra Kai I have watched in my life, so for that reason, I think Breaking Bad has just made it this far because it's gone against horrible TV shows. Cobra Kai is going through to the semi-finals. Sex Education versus The Office. Sex Education's had its run up to now, but The Office is... The Office is good. The Office is quality. The Office is quality. So The Office is going through. This is where it gets mad. Modern Family versus Stranger Things. You guys are probably sitting by your TV or whatever you're watching this on right now, screaming at me. I won't be surprised if the remote has been thrown into the TV by now. I think Stranger Things is a cinematic masterpiece. But in terms of my preference, my friend's Modern Family is going through to the semi-finals. And then there were four. Cobra Kai versus Friends. Cobra Kai has had its lucky run up to now, but Friends is nowhere for it to be matched. Friends is going through to the best TV show in the world final. What's The Office and Modern Family? Modern Family is going through. For third place for the best TV show of all time, it's between The Office and it's between Cobra Kai. I can't lie, I have no idea how Cobra Kai's made it this far. They beat The Simpsons. How did Cobra Kai beat The Simpsons? What? What? Why? Who let that, who let that happen? Simply because of Peyton List, Cobra Kai is going through. Cobra Kai, you have to watch the entire thing. The Office, you could watch an episode of it and get it. The Office. Office is third place. The Office is the third best TV show in the world, full stop. But this is the grand finale. Modern Family versus Friends. Modern Family just hits different. I don't know, I don't know what to say. I, don't, I can't decide, I can't decide. I can't decide. It's the best TV show ever made. Modern Family. Now I'm sure a lot of you are probably like, Phoenix, what the heck has gone on? What, what, like, what's gone wrong here? Go vote on my Instagram. Don't know what else to say. All the votes are up live now. So go and vote for your favorite TV show of all time and let's see. Let's see whose controversial opinion is the real controversial opinion. You know what I'm saying? Listen, thank you all very much for watching this very controversial video. If you did enjoy, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and go follow my socials. And of course, please go over and vote for your favorite TV show of all time on my Instagram. So I hope you have a lovely day. Modern Family wins the best TV show of all time. Thank you very much for watching. I love you.